What's going on people? It's your boy Theo. I am back with a real talk. So in the last hour or so, I have heard about the news that's um, going down in Star City. Um, now, many people that know me would, would know that I love um, Birmingham. I love my city. This is where I'm from. This is where my family's from. And, you know, I always have a great connection with um, the city, you know, wherever I go. And Star City is one of them. I spent many of time going down there. Um, and um, I've seen good films over the years. I've played bowling there. Um, I've made some good memories there, you know. And um, what I've heard tonight was utterly disturbing. So apparently there was a group of guys down there who are carrying machetes. And the police had... Um, lock the place down I don't know if it's still locked down I'm presuming that it still is at the time of this recording and there was a lot of kids down there um, I'm I'm hearing that they uh, was looking to see the new Frozen 2 movie and yeah it's not something that kids want to see it's not something that you know, you know young families can you know come but like you know I'm sorry, I'm just a bit um, shocked by this news because, you know, it's not a place for violence. It's not a place where, you know, something like that can happen and, you know, you can never ever go there again because, you know, you never know what could happen. You know, I know these days, in this day and age, right, we have um, a big knife crime problem and, you know, and there's violence out on the streets. And this is what kind of um, annoys me that not even the government is solving that problem right now. Um, but uh, but yeah, I'm just kind of I'm just staggered. Um, I don't like what's happened. I don't like what what I've heard. Um, and I only can hope that you know there is um, no injuries. I hope that the people out there has been arrested and and the and the the machetes have been um, um been removed and you know and dealt and and you know I, I hope that the police can deal with the situation because nobody likes seeing those kind of things. I don't like seeing those things, you know, and I don't like seeing violence on the streets. You know, I I, I always thought that we should be better than that, and I keep saying this so with. With, with videos that's with videos pertaining to this sort of issue and I just don't like it man I don't like what's happening on the streets I really don't and I don't know what we're gonna do to end the violence end this stigma you know when we go out there we're supposed to go out there and enjoy ourselves we're supposed to go out there and go out there and you know mind our own business and and whatnot now you know in this day and age you know, people can't do that. There's always something that happens. There's always something that goes on. There's always something that people does to annoy somebody for it to escalate into a situation, you know, and it's not great. I don't know. I don't know. Let me know in the comment section um, of what you think. Um, there's a big, big problem. I don't know what to do. I, I, I don't know what to do. I just want to be able to live my life out uh, positively and I want to reach out to people. I want to be able to say to people that, you know, we can live in a better society and we can live um, as one people. I always believed that, but I don't, I, I'm, I'm losing the will to live because, you know, nobody is actually going to, you know, wake up and, and realize this this fact that we can go on better but you know i don't understand why these things have to happen so yeah um let me know in the comment section um below um it's a deep one this week this is and i'm being real because i love my city i love where i come from i love star city and uh, you know wherever i go in birmingham i always um i'm in respect of, of it you know because you know i've it's it's close to me, you know, and I, I I just don't like seeing bad things happen. Yeah, I'm out, people.